Okay, I need you guys to pay attention because today we are talking about how I actually get stuff done. I mean the literal backbone of my job. Okay, today I'm giving you the MacBook tour. Specifically, this is my work laptop. This is a 2020 MacBook Air with an M1 chip with shockingly 16 gigabytes of memory. She is tiny but mighty and keeps my whole work life running. Um, so I'm just going to go over the most used things on my Mac and I'll just get into it. How I use this every single day. Let's talk about it. Let's start with my ride or die Figma. Obviously I talk about it all the time as a UX designer, you do too. I'd say even a good 80% of my day here, whether it's a jam, even in the community pages, obviously Figma design, prototyping, um, prototyping, wireframing, taking notes, doing journey maps, all of that happens in Figma. It's basically, it's basically my second brain. If I didn't have my Figma, I wouldn't have anything. On the theme of design, next up is Excaldra. And when I want to think visually, but I don't want the pressure of even putting anything into Figma, even Fig Jam, this is where I go to Excaldra. It's like even lowest, lowest, lowest fidelity compared to something you would create in Figma. Um, it's almost like, literally it's like pen and paper but just translated into the web like a web version like it's really sketchy it's really loose and it's a quick quick way to just get your ideas across you can wireframe you can explain your weird ux flow ideas without worrying about making anything look pretty next is my secret secret weapon for inspiration which is modin you know sometimes i'm just in there like i just need like a quick reference on how something works in the real world like last week i were last week i was looking at um how you know when you get an email and you unsubscribe it takes you to that screen of like are you sure and tell us why i was just looking for inspiration on like how other places are doing it and i am just doom scrolling not even doom scrolling <laughs> positively scrolling because it feels like a designer's pinterest because there's so many so many apps and websites that we all know i love mobbin for that you know you can find yourself in a little bit of a rabbit hole so <laughs> tread lightly tread lightly next is great question and this is if you are doing any kind of user research, this is a tool that we use. It's gonna be company, company specific. Even at my current job, we were using user testing. Now we use Great Question. And I really like using Great Question. You know, I find it a little bit underrated. I don't hear it talked about all that often, but this is where you send out user interviews, you send out surveys. This is how you send out your screeners for participants. Um, there's a lot of great AI features. It does a lot of recordings for you. You can send incentives. It does a lot of the heavy lifting. And all you have to do now is just log onto the call, talk to your customer and it does so much of the assisting for you. Like it, it has a great repository. You can tag what people say. Like I'm, I'm pretty impressed. I haven't done, I haven't used that many research tools, but great question. 10 out of 10, 10 out of 10. And the next of course is Slack. We all know Slack. I'm not gonna touch on it too long. It's the communication tool of choice of our company. Um, I have used other ones. I've used Teams. I do not, I hate Teams. I'm really happy that we have Slack, mainly because I'm on there chatting with my coworker besties, sending emoji, <laughs> sending gifts and emojis, and obviously the real work happens there too. I never get emails that are actually con contextual. All my emails are like calendar invites, company-wide blasts, reminders, like that's literally, that's literally it. Everything else communication-wise about any project happens in Slack. Okay, yes, I'll have everything I talked about linked below. I think a lot of them are going to be like corporate based. Like you're most likely going to want like a corporate, like a corporate account, Slack, great question. But Mobbit is not corporate. You can be an individual user, highly recommend them. There's a link down there for you guys. Um, Cause it's pretty affordable monthly to get access to everything. Let me know in the comments, what are your most used apps, websites, drop your favorite tool. I'm always looking for new ones. So let me know down in the comments below and I'll see you guys in the next one.